Okay students, this video we will be drawing the second question. The second question is to draw a square given the length of the diagonal. The first step is to draw the diagonal ESC at 45 degrees and 70 millimeters long. So we'll start by drawing this line. Any length is fine. I have the point A, I will draw 90 and bisect the 90 to get the 45. 45 is half of 90 okay first step is to draw 90 degrees I have drawn the semicircle I take my compass open it more than A and draw the first arc when you have drawn this first arc you follow the semicircle you notice I extended the line because it was not enough so I draw the arc wherever the arcs meet that should be the 90 degrees so draw the line so now that you have the 90 degrees we need to bisect the 90 degrees to get the 45 so you place your compass there draw the first arc follow the semicircle where the semicircle meets the line do not open or close your compass draw the arc wherever the arcs meet that should be the 45 degrees so you draw the line and that is the 45 degrees so we have the 45 degrees here at vertex e and following from the question this line should have a length draw the diagonal ESC at 45 degrees and 70 millimeters long so this line is supposed to be 7 centimeters long so you measure it with your ruler and you put the point C so now that we have the point C 7 centimeters step number two is to bisect ESC and to draw the perpend in the perpendicular bisector through O so we bisect ESC dividing a line into two equal parts with our compass we place our compass at point C, open it to more than half of A, and you draw arcs above and below the line AC. So the first one on top, and underneath. Take the center of your compass, place it at A, draw the arc underneath, let the arcs meet underneath and on top now do not get confused with the arcs wherever these arcs intersect that is the perpendicular bisector of the line EC arcs intersect here and here that's the line that we will draw okay so that's center O wherever the lines meet and we will be doing the third step the third step says O is the center of the circle radius OE so what we will do we will take our compass place it at center of our compass at O open it to E and we will draw a circle now you will notice something that it matches or it's the same size as C because it's the perpendicular bisector so we will draw the circle and we will get the four points of the square so draw the circle and you will notice that something very interesting happens it matches with the perpendicular bisector on these lines the circle and the perpendicular bisector is giving us the four points of the square that is a look at the perpendicular bisector that is b c we already have it perpendicular bisector that is d so we have a b c and d we darken and this will be our square 
so this is the square students I have darkened A, B, C, D with the center O in between only the square is supposed to be darkened notice I did not measure the 3 millimeters for the letters because some of you are doing it in your notebooks and it is fine but I did ask you to write your name in pen so at the top of every drawing before you take the picture and you send it to me you write your name in pen and that's what I will be correcting from you so this is our second drawing enjoy